The word for today, you can conquer your fear. According to psychiatric reference, approximately 2,000 classified fears exist. What's interesting is that psychiatrists say we are born with only two innate ones, the fear of falling and the fear of loud noises. That means we learn every other fear. And more importantly, it means we can unlearn every other fear. The majority of us are shaped, for better or worse, by a handful of experiences. These defining experiences can plant a seed of confidence or a seed of uncertainty, a seed of hope or a seed of vulnerability, a seed of faith or a seed of fear. John expresses the end goal of our relationship with God. There is no fear in love, but perfect love drives out fear. 1 John 4, 18. The words perfect love do not describe our love for God, but rather God's unconditional, unearned, unfailing love for us. A pastor writes, the goal of love is fearlessness. As we grow in a love relationship with God, we unlearn the fears that paralyze us and neutralize us spiritually. That is the essence of faith. Faith is the process of unlearning your irrational fears. The only God-ordained fear is the fear of God. And if we fear, love, honor, reverence, and respect God, we don't have to fear anyone or anything else. Unlearning our fears is really a process of learning to trust God more and more. One of God's greatest promises is, I will never leave you nor forsake you. So we may boldly say, the Lord is my helper, I will not fear. Hebrews 13, 5-6. That is the word for today.